good morning. So we didn't really do, well, we did a bit of videoing yesterday, but we didn't really do anything. We just drove from Paluma National Park to Mission Beach and then just set up shot where we are. Um, a bit expensive, like $70 a night. And we're not even in Mission Beach, we're about 10 minutes south, but it's coming close to school holidays now, so that kind of makes sense. But we are taking the boat out today. Just opposite from where we are is Dunk Island, so keen to get the boat out somewhere that wasn't near Mackay. And hopefully not as windy as the last time we tried to put the boat out, because it was windy. But it's not perfect sunshine, it has been raining a bit, but keen to get the fishing line in the water. It's like the first official fishing trip of the trip. Good eye. Keen to go fishing? Yeah, good bite in the water. So what are you hoping to catch today? Oh, anything will be good. <laughs> no, I might go and drive for some mackerel. We'll see how the weather is on the other side of the island. See how we go. I'd smack some mackerel for dinner. Yeah, I could go a bit of mackerel. Smoke. It's so typical. We've had like perfect sunshine so far over the last week. And then, first of all, I did laundry this morning and then it rained. So that was a vibe. And then, secondly, we were going to put the boat in the water today. And it's like, it's just on and off rain. And like, it's not too windy, is it? Oh, it's it's going to be windy out there, isn't it? It's going to be a little bit windy. Yeah, so. It's just not ideal boating weather, I suppose. Not ideal. It's like every time we go to put the boat in the water at the moment, it's not ideal boating weather. That is okay. Go get fuel and we'll take the boat out. So we've been that idea. We're still at the moment kind of learning the I guess the limits of it and the ocean's just a bit too angry. We're not worried about getting out, we're worried about when we try to get it back in. The waves are pretty angry at the moment, so I think I might just go to the creek. That seems like it'd make a lot more sense. We're on the water. Uh, yep. We definitely need to get better at launching the boat in crop waters though. We've just watched a couple do it after us and we were like, that was way more organized than we were. And apparently there's a big croc that lives around here so hopefully we might get to see him. Um, I think we'll stay away from the edge though as much as possible. It's nice though, this is nice, hey? Yeah. Going just like no luck with the fishy so far. Now we're trying a bit of trolling, but. It is beautiful. And I bet the color of the water is just not gonna show up on the GoPro, which is very frustrating. Cause it is honestly stunning. It's just like one of those things that like, you watch on video and stuff and you're just like, oh yeah, it looks nice up there, eh? Then you get here and you're like, wow, it's actually, it's actually really nice up here. That is Dunk Island where we were going to go, but you can probably already hear it on the GoPro. The wind is already cooking down this channel, so I 
should imagine it's pretty windy and gross out there. Probably a good job we did just stay at the creek. Shane was saying it's definitely more than the 10 knots it was supposed to be. And we're currently having issues with our electric motor, just beeping at us. We don't know if we're recording a route. Maybe we are recording a route, Shane, and that's where the GPS light's flashing. But we don't want to turn the electric motor off and like restart it because it's trolling for us at the moment, so. But seriously, beautiful. you would have been able to see it on that last video. But that's the second castle area I've seen today. Mission Beach is obviously full of them. How'd you find the first fishing trip of the trip, Shane? Oh, it wasn't great, but we can, we can improve. Started from the bottom. I guess say now we're here, because we're not the here there, but we started from the bottom. No fishies, one lost, but beautiful scenery. So hopefully next time we go out in the boat will be a little bit more productive. But the weather has absolutely turned it on in the end. Now the plan is to just get some groceries we need. And then there is apparently a brewery. Brewery? Brewery in Mission Beach. We're gonna go have a beer, do Shana's favorite thing. So does the garage bar and brew house get your ticket of approval? Yeah, it's pretty good. It's a good pale ale. Good pale ale. The lager was nice too, but the pale ale was really good. So if you're into your beers and you come into Mission Beach, definitely worth a stop in. There's also another bar, like well, two bars, like right at the front here, but we didn't go to them. The pale ale was too good, so we stayed. Cool to come down this way. Yeah. Like come down for dinner here or something? We're still trying to wheedle out our bougie tendencies, which are used to fine dining and drinking out all the time, but we just obviously don't really have the budget for that anymore. Despite catching no fish, today was still a good day. <laughs> Boat's all packed up again, ready to go. Other than that, we'll see you in the morning. Night. Good morning. Good eye. <laughs> I feel like we start every single day exactly the same. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, weather is turning it on for boating. At least this morning it is. Shane thinks the wind might pick up the Sarvi. So we are going to try again getting the boat in the water in the ocean. But we're going to do a beach launch instead of the boat ramp. Shane reckons that's the easier way to go about it when we're getting it back in. recording to help Shana get it in but it went in pretty easily. It was such a nice day. This is what we were hoping for yesterday.
Oh, it's a big chain. Yeah. Oh, no. It's going to be delicious. Oh, look at you go! That's epic! initial put back on of the boat on the beach because the electric winch the battery on the boat died <laughs> so we had to use the hand winch and then it kind of freaked out halfway through so you know catch on Shano <laughs> right. you must be a happy boy yeah that's good much better day than yesterday hey oh yeah Every time. Um, we were really happy with this morning. Finally, something worked out. We can't wait for your chicken wings. You're gonna get a chicken wing. So, we went off basically straight from Wollongong? Wollongong, where we're we'll, staying at the beach. The beach that's in between Mission Beach and South Beach. Um, just launched straight off there and we're heading over to Dunk Island. Then we realised that we probably didn't have enough fuel with three of us in the boat. It just wasn't getting up on the plane to go. Fast. Yeah, it's just struggling. We're only sitting at like seven knots. That was a very slow journey and yeah, not ideal. And using a lot of fuel. A lot of fuel. And we just didn't want to run out of fuel in the middle of nowhere. So we made the decision to go back, but Shane decided to put the trolls out and yeah, hooked on a little baby mackerel, chucked the line back out again and bam, straight on. Happy boy. Mm, yeah, it's good. And then we they we could see them around on the fish finder, but they were evading us. They didn't take many more bites, the little cheeky buggers. If you ever get a still flat day around Mission Beach, for you to hold a foot the boat in the water. Uh, what, did you, what did you just say? So you've got to have a beer after you go fishing. So that's Australian oil. Oh, I'm having lots of fun. The way to the stop. Still learning so much about being Australian though. Even though I've lived here for eight and a half years. <laughs> We're just driving up to the oh, in between Innisfail and Vinda. And the drive 
expect that it's a Friday and it's school holiday starting, so we knew we were pushing it. Yeah, we're just going to stay at the Rotary Park in town, so we'll probably do the boulders tomorrow. And we're having fresh mackerel for dinner. <laughs> so we will start vlogging some of Shano's excellent cooking because Shano is a very good cook. Um, and is one of those people that is 100% believes that any meal you cook at home, you can cook whilst camping. Shano's been down for a swimmy swim. Delicious. <laughs> apparently we've got to go join. Apparently it's beautiful. So, which is pretty good, I think, to have a free camp, have a free swimming spot right, right there. Who needs to stay at Babinda Boulders? That's me, bro. <laughs> we better leave Madonna Ice. Thanks for watching episode two of our adventures around Australia. Next week, we do one of our favorite drives from Cairns to Port Douglas and explore Mossman Gorge. If you liked this video, we'd love it if you click the like button. And if you want to see more content from us, make sure you hit subscribe. As always, thanks so much for watching. We do really appreciate it and we will see you next week.